Hi, everyone. Did you miss me? Did you miss me? Because I missed you. Anyway, welcome back to my channel for all my followers and all my OGs on this street. Welcome, welcome, welcome. If you're new here, welcome. Uh, my name is Amarachi. Thank you for stopping by. You will know more about me throughout the course of this video. Now, down to the whole point of this video, which I know many people you know are interested in. Well, I'm sure you already know what this video is about from the title, but before I go into it, I just want to take us back, you know, to how this started, uh, the journey on YouTube. So for those who didn't know, I started this channel, I think like in 2017 or 2018, it's been a long time, right? And I made like a few videos and I stopped making videos for a long time, for years. And then when I relocated to Lithuania in 2019, I decided to restart it. So I restarted this channel during the lockdown in 2020. You know, there was like so much free time on my hands. I wasn't doing anything. And I thought, oh, why not, you know, like come back to this channel, you know, make videos and entertain people while I entertain myself. And that was how this channel was born. And throughout the course of, you know, having this YouTube channel, I experimented with several different contents. I had a cooking video, I had vlogs, I had like different things. I also had, you know, videos that I talked about Nigeria. I actually had like many different things in my videos. But one thing that I realized was that most people were watching my Lithuania content. So I realized that a lot of people were coming to my channel to know more about Lithuania. And at that point, I niched down to talking about, you know, living and working in Lithuania. So that was when I started making all the videos to answer your questions. I used to get a lot of messages and questions on social media, you know, asking about Lithuania, asking, you know, how to move, how to relocate, asking about school, asking about cost of living, so many questions. So. Um, I tried to answer these questions using my videos and also like answered some people that I could in the DMs on Instagram or on Twitter. So basically that was the entire point of this YouTube channel to showcase my life in Lithuania. And I know that's how many of you found me by searching for information or content about Lithuania and coming across my video and my channel and staying so it's a bit emotional you know like and i don't want it to look like i betrayed you guys so it's a bit emotional to come here to tell you that i no longer live in lithuania but if you have messaged me recent times on instagram because i still get dms from people asking me about lithuania i also still get some comments in my old videos asking about lithuania and how to move here and for many of you my response has been i no longer live there i've not the best person to help you and for many people who know i always direct you to other channels of lithuania based youtubers who can help you kindness is my favorite like i always direct people to kindness because i feel like her content and her video is more up to date seeing as she still lives in lithuania and she also studied in lithuania so i always felt like she's the best person to answer your question but yeah that's not what this video is about <laughs> So yeah, uh, I let the cast out of the bag, but yeah, I moved out of Lithuania last year. And it's been quite emotional for me, or it was emotional for me living. I moved to Lithuania in September of 2019, and I lived there up until July 2022. So I spent almost three years in that beautiful country. I grew my career, I made a lot of friends. I grew this channel, I made videos for you all. So much happened. I don't know if you follow me on Instagram, but if you do, I also made a reel We're talking about when I relocated. So it's pretty much a bittersweet experience. And I know that many people would have the question, oh, why did you leave Lithuania? Oh, I want to come to Lithuania. What does it mean that you're leaving? Does it mean I shouldn't come? Does it mean I should come? You know, all that questions. And I hope that I can answer this question. But the first thing I'm going to say is that I did not leave Lithuania because it was a bad country. To be honest, I had like so many, so many amazing experiences in Lithuania. Lithuania was a great place for me to leave. And the reason why I eventually moved away from Lithuania was because I felt like my priorities in life and the things that I wanted, you know, kept changing and I wanted like a change of environment. So if you actually follow my videos, you know that I moved to Kaunas when I moved to Lithuania and after a while I moved to Vilnius, right? 
I have just always lived in so many different places or so many different cities all my life. Even while in Nigeria, I grew up in one city, schooled in a different city, worked in yet another city. I finally left Nigeria. So that has been my life. It's nothing new that I uprooted myself again and moved to a whole new city in a whole new country. So yeah, why did I move? Like I already said, I wanted a change. For me, it was it was many things, right? I wanted like a new challenge in my career. I wanted to go to a place with um, more opportunities. Um, I also wanted a place where the black community and the Nigerian community was in lot more. If you know me, you know that I am very, I like to be out there. I'm very extroverted and very social. So I always need human interaction, you know, to thrive. And as much as I had like a very beautiful community that, you know, like I nurtured and I hung out with in Lithuania, it was, it was almost like it wasn't really growing in that sense. Same people that I was hanging out with in 2000 and 19 and 2020 were the same people I was still hanging out with in 2022. My network wasn't really growing. Although, of course, I would admit that I met new people, but they were few in number. I wanted a bigger, wider community. And I also wanted a bigger, wider community. Another reason why I moved away from Lithuania was because I wanted more diversity right and it has nothing to do with lithuania lithuania is a small country and when you think about it lithuania is like pretty young and it wasn't like so long ago that they got their independence but the thing is that there's there are still not a lot of internationals living in lithuania because of that it wasn't diverse enough for me and i wanted more diversity i wanted more razzle dazzle <laughs> You see, that was, you know, one important reason why I moved away to a place more diverse. Another thing that I wanted was, you know, social life. Again, I like to be out there and at a point in time, there was only so much that Lithuania could offer me. There was only so much that Vilnius could offer me being the capital of Lithuania. So I wanted more, like I wanted to have more activities. I wanted to have more fun and I'm sure even Lithuanians will be able to relate to what I'm saying in terms of more fun. Lithuania is cool, Lithuania is nice, but in terms of fun, yeah, so that was another reason why I moved out of Lithuania. So the thing about Lithuania is that it felt to me like Lithuania was a place where you can come, have the calm, chill life, raise a family, just like retire, things are affordable. You live a good life, right? But at this at this point, at this point in my life and at this point in my career, I felt like I wasn't looking for chill yet. I'm young, I'm single. I this is the time to search for excitement. This is the time to search for adventure. This is the time to explore and see the world, right? And I felt like I would be doing myself a disservice to keep living like I had retired. I mean, it's one thing to have family there and want to be with your family and choose that life. But it's another thing to be like a single person who has a lot more to experience. I felt like it became my comfort zone. I felt like I wasn't doing enough. I felt like I wasn't doing as much as I could. and. I really just wanted to explore all that was possible for me and I figured that to do that I had to move away. So yeah, where did I move to? If you follow me on social media, you already know this because like I feel like I'm an open book, you know everything about me at every point in time but I understand that it's only on YouTube that most of you see me so you wouldn't know but I moved to Berlin, Germany. Yeah, so uh, I am now a Berliner. <laughs> and how has it been? Oh, it's been interesting. It's been great. It's been fun moving here. I feel like I should probably make another video, you know, comparing, 
you know what living in lithuania and living in germany you know feels like like what are the differences so if you want to see that video let me know in the comment section um that you know you're interested in seeing the differences and then i will make that video but yeah i live in berlin now <laughs> and one of the reasons why I'm making this video is to explain myself. I don't want to just come and jump into making content um, about Germany or living in Germany without explaining the transition or without giving you all a transition um, video. So that is what I'm making now. I'm here to let you all know that my content will be changing and i know that i would like you like new subscribers because if you're here for lithuania content and i no longer give you lithuania content i will understand that you go elsewhere to find the kind of content that you're looking for but i do hope that you stay i do hope that you're interested in my life enough to know you know what the next adventure for me is and i also think that if you are looking for lithuania content because um, you're also like exploring countries to relocate to or to visit then you should you should probably stay around to also get germany content you know from me because i'm hoping that i can give you all like tips and you know helpful information about living here about moving here about building a life here that is the plan for my videos going forward right so i really truly truly hope that you stay with me because i plan to stay with you and let me know the kind of videos the kind of things you want to know about germany the kind of questions you have but i also think that before i transition i should make one or two videos you know about lithuania maybe answer the last few questions i got about lithuania and maybe do the differences in both cities and both countries but i need to know that you know you want to see that content so please tell me if you want to see that content yeah so i'm hoping that you know, if you want to see it i can make like two more videos to finally completely wrap up my lithuania content and after that you will probably be seeing just like new videos from me about my life in germany or about travel i don't know what it's going to be but i have decided to you know instead of overthinking and trying to figure out what i should make what i should talk about i can just like start and with time the more videos i make the more I understand the kind of videos you want to see and make more of those videos. So this is a learning process for me. This is a discovery process for me. This is a journey for me that I hope that you will stick with me through because I need you. <laughs> yeah, I need you. And I think that I'm going to prove prove to you <laughs> that you need me too. But like, you know, it's still me. It's still the old me. Still I well. Okay, I'm joking, but yeah. Yeah, so that's about it for this video. And I hope that, you know, you enjoyed it. If you watched until the end, thank you. I'm excited that you're interested in me, you know. And I really, truly hope to go through your comments and um, respond to you. And if you enjoyed this video, please like, please share it with your friends, please you know, give me a shout out, whatever it is that you can do to support me. And I am excited about going on this new journey with you all. And yeah, I will see you in my next video. Bye.